Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of St. Peter's Prep is brought to you by Jersey City Medical Center. Big time basketball in North Jersey means big crowds. That's what we've got Wednesday night in the non-public A North sectional final. St. Peter's Prep clashes with Bergen Catholic. The Crusaders upset top-seeded Don Bosco Prep in the semifinals earlier this week. This was a back and forth game early. Naeem Parrish pulls up from beyond the arc and knocks down the triple. Jackson Tyndall answers back for St. Peter's with a three of his own. The Marauders trail by two. Bergen Catholic stays in front to close the first. Brandon Benjamin dials up a three. The Crusaders go up 16-11 after one quarter. Bergen continues to work in the second. Declan Vuker Fennig drives the baseline and throws one down. Then David Monroe joins the party later. This bucket has the Crusaders lead up to 12. It's 29-17. Mason Santiago had the only two St. Peter's baskets in the second quarter. Count it and the foul. The Marauders trail 31-21 at the halftime break. Early in the third, Bergen Catholic is still in control. Tyler McQuaid dives and buries the layup. The lead is back up to 12. The Marauders, well, they're in a deep hole. They begin to chip away. Count the hoop and the foul for Matt Kinsler here. And then it's Nico Pena who brings St. Peter's Prep back to life. Pena hits a huge three. And then in transition, he sinks the floater. Timeout, Bergen Catholic. We've got a three-point game. Remember that 12-point deficit? Well, it's gone. Ben Guy drills the corner three. He's feeling it, and we're tied up at 41 all. St. Peter's Prep closes the third with the lead. It's Jackson Tyndall for two more. The Marauders go up 45-43, headed to the fourth. Buckle up for a wild fourth quarter. Austin Spencer's triple gives Bergen Catholic the lead back, but Nico Pena answers with three more of his own. The Prep lead 48-46 with under five minutes to play. Now with under three minutes to go, it's Terry Copeland. He hits the shot, but Copeland gets teed up right after. He can't believe it and a conversation with the referee doesn't change anything. Ben Guy steps to the line and hits both free throws. St. Peter's leads 54-51. Ben Guy was so clutch from the charity stripe late in this game, he went six for six on free throws in the fourth quarter. The Marauders lead 56-51 with under a minute to go. We are officially in crunch time. Bergen Catholic would close the gap thanks to free throws of their own. Naeem Parrish goes three for three here, and then Terry Copeland goes one for two from the line right after. The Crusaders get it within one. They trail 56-55. So the game ultimately comes down to this. 11 and a half seconds left on the clock. Bergen Catholic inbounding, trailing by one. The Crusaders run their play. Spencer's floater is off the mark. Naeem Parrish gets a clean look. His shot, no good. There's the buzzer. St. Peter's Prep wins a thriller. 56-55 is the final. There's absolute mayhem in Franklin. The Marauders rally back from 12 points down in the third to knock off the three-time reigning sectional champions. Yes, we feel like we have something to prove. The last eight years, it's been Bergen or Bosco, Bergen or Bosco. That's what Coach been saying, and it's time for a change, and we did that. Uh, we knew we had to do come into the second half. We knew we were down 10 points, but we had to keep a positive attitude to come back and win the game. We know they play, uh, they throw the ball into the bigs a lot, and we know that's what we have to do to stop them. I mean, at halftime, I, I told the guys, I said, yo, this is it right here. 16 minutes of play, and there's a winner that's going to be decided. I said, we want to be that. So we want to be the toughest team, the, the, the most together team, and, you know, come out with the win and make free throws, and that's what we did. St. Peter's Prep will face Union Catholic in the non-public A state championship on Friday night at Rutgers University. Reporting from Franklin High School, I'm Jay Cook.
JerseySportsZone.com.